Early Christmas advent calendar. You guys, I think we found something that's not supposed to be quite out yet. So normally I go to Target on my way to work every day and I stop and I get a Red Bull and then I check out and normally I like to look at the Pokemon stuff next to the checkout. And today when we walked in, this bad boy was sitting there. I have a receipt for it. We'll post it in here somewhere. Probably just a picture because I don't know where it's at. I think it's in my backpack still. But how cool is that? I did look on YouTube and I think I've only seen two other people at this point have this on uploaded so hopefully maybe we'll be the third person to upload this if uh, if I can get this out there in time but we'll see it's kind of a crunch time for this normally I take my time to edit and upload and I haven't watched either or of the videos so I don't know exactly what's in here I'm super excited I apologize about the lighting it's really bad um, I need to work on my lighting let me flip this camera but check it out how cool I, I haven't even actually checked on the Pokemon Center to see if it's for sale yet on there. It might be. I'm not too sure. I'm not sure how early this is. Um, I did pick up last year's, but this year uh, I hadn't seen much on it. I, and I don't know where it's just sitting on my target. So super excited for this. Um, we are in the Chicago area. So I don't know if there's more around here in the area or or if it was like just everywhere. But let's get this out. Well, first, let's look at the back, I guess. I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm just really excited to open this and be probably one of the few people that has seen this this early. But it has eight foils, eight foil Pokemon TCG cards with a Festus stamp. It has the snowflake like, like last year. Uh, five Pokemon TCG booster packs, seven Pokemon TCG three card phone packs, seven? Seven of those, really? Uh, two Pokemon coins, two Pokemon sticker sheets, one sidekick dangler. Is that, that one says sidekick dangler featuring Pikachu and Glaceon. And then a plus find a code card for the Pokemon TCG Live. Okay, so last year for the little dangler, they did um, Pikachu and um, oh, I'm blanking. I'm blanking, but it, it's a really cool one. I have it somewhere around here laying around. Um, I cannot remember the name. But I'm excited to see what all of the sets are in it. I mean, it, it's a it's it's kind of big, so it's hard to see on here all together. But that's the image that does the back. I think I just threw my old one away not too long ago. I might have the outside of it, but I want to say the box itself I threw away. And then here's the front. We'll do it sideways again. Check that out, man. Del Deli Bird, Deli Bird is the one they had. So we're just gonna crack through all of them. Uh, like I said, it's it's pretty, I don't think it's supposed to be out quite yet. So I'm pretty stoked to see. So box number one, or slide number one, the Glaceon. Now, didn't this Glaceon come out last year as well? I'll have to go back and look. Actually, it should be somewhere right here. I have it. Okay, no, no, no. I think it was, uh, it was not the Glaceon that was on there last year. No, it was. It was. Was it? I have this one, but I don't, it might not be part of it. It might be doesn't have the stamp so I don't think it is I think it's just one that I had in there and I'm confusing it for it but I'll have to go watch that video now but here's the, the Glaceon oh what's behind door number two and we have 25 of these to go through we have a Pelda evolved okay Pelda. let's crack it see if we can pull anything man this was crazy they had two I only got one so hopefully somebody else locally got to pick it up and oh I oh, do I see something I might see something it might just be the regular hollow border though but we'll see oh there we go we'll take that and oh we did get something Falconer 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 we'll take it that is pretty good we're doing really good with this box so far man that is that you know 
Literally, guys, no words right now. Okay. Okay, box number two. Okay, I think this is the pin or the little sidekick dangler. It's definitely bigger than last year. This one's really pretty too. Check it out. Super nice. I like that. I want to start saving them and using them as Christmas tree ornaments for when, for when we have our little Christmas tree for Christmas. Next card is gonna be, let's see. Okay, Stantler. Is that the Cosmo Hollow Foil? I think it might be the Cosmo Hollow Foil. Definitely different though. We'll take that. Check them out. See if we can get that Hollow to sparkle one more time. Oh, we're really struggling to get that Hollow to sparkle. But it's there, I promise. And the lighting's super bad in here, guys. Super, super bad. It's it's terrible. I gotta, I gotta fix it. There's a really bad lighting up top and then really bad directional lighting and you get some key lights okay fusion strike throwing it back to fusion strike man that that one i did not see coming okay i want to say it's uh three from the back one two three no four from the back i hope it's four from the back yeah four from the back so that's behind door number five Battle VIP pass, we actually need that one. I was just gonna have to go look for some. Let's see. I don't know, this, these look really dark though. I will say the, the color on them feels a little bit darker than originally. Oh, coming off screen. Okay, we got a Shroomish and a Evil Toss. Nothing crazy out of that pack. Definitely need that Battle VIP though, setting that off to the side. Now, behind door number six have another pack i think it's one of those smaller three packs yeah the fun packs we'll crack them man it'll be really cool if we we are the third person to upload this nothing in there either not surprised with those can you even actually get hits out of these has anybody actually got a hit scarlet and violet oh that one cracked super easy Let's see, we have a, okay, a hollow, reverse hollow. Okay, let's see. Next on here we have, where is it at? Number eight, on day number eight, we have a, another card. I already forgot how many it said it came with. And let's see, so we have a, okay. I cannot pronounce that. Glasterior, Glasterior? I know him as a uh, ice rider normally with the little the other dude that sits on top, but we will take that one. That one's pretty too. I like that. Put it off to the side. I don't know if you can hear my dog. If you can hear my dog, I'm sorry about that. Okay, this is a full pack. We have a scarlet and violet pack. Okay, let's see. Are we still recording? Oh, my heart sank for a second. I was like, did I even hit record? Okay, code card. Let's see. Oh, there's something in there too, I think. It might have been just a hollow border. These always get me. Let's see. And, oh. And, oh, we did get something. Magna Zone EX. Definitely doing pretty good with this. these uh, these packs over here. Definitely pretty good. Okay. Day number 10, bring into Vulpix. What's the coin? Last year it was, I think, Deli Bird as well. Let's see what we have this year. We have a Snom. Check him out. That's cool too. I like that. Okay. Coming off screen. Let's see. I've got a bunch of stuff up right up top where you can't see. Oh, we got a sneeze coming. We have a sneeze. And <coughs> Ooh, there it is. Okay. With that out of the way, we got our first sticker sheet. Deli Bird and Pikachu. Is that all we got in there? Oh, and we got a Vulpix and a Snom in there. And there's a sticker sheet. I didn't. I still have the one from last year. It's in the penny sleeve, so that one will get saved too. Day number 12. Let's see. We got another Pokemon card. Okay. Let's see what it is. I wonder what the last one is. I know the last one for last year was, I think, the Ice Rider. We have a... Ooh, check that out. That's cool. Pikachu... Did end day with the snowflake and that other hollow foil. 
we will take that one. That's epic. I think last year I said I was going to grade or try to grade the other ones. I, I, ne I never sent them. I still have them. Maybe I'll have to send all of them in one go. Another fusion strike. Oh, I see a total dial. Let's see. Oh, this pack just did not open good. Code card. One, two, three, four from the back. Come on, keep the good, good hits rolling. We need a really good hit here. Not for any particular reason, just because I really want a good hit here. It'd be cool to have a good hit. Got that Snom. Zerpy. We got a Gliscar. And not a good hit. We got Azumarill. Not that you're not a good hit, Azumarill, but no offense there. Okay, day 14. Oh, let's see. But yeah, definitely, I guess, start keeping an eye out at your targets. Like I said, mine had two, so I don't think they... If they are stalking them, um, then they're out there. I could be completely wrong, and these could be rolling out already. But it just, I don't think I've seen them on the Pokemon Center. But like, like I said, this would be really cool if it was early. It better be early. Let's see. This one's not opening as well. It's a Fusion Strike too. Last year we had some fusion strike, I want to say. There's going to be a banger hit in this one. No, no banger hit. Okay, okay, 16. I've been waiting at work too all day to come home and, and open this. Okay, let's see what we have. We have a cryognal. Okay, we'll take it too. That one looks pretty. The hollow foil is really pretty on it. I mean, all of them have the same hollow foil, but looking at them in person, they're really nice. We're gonna set them over here. Day 17. Another pack. Scarlet and Violet. Now I'm really wondering if you can get a hit out of these. If you've ever gotten a hit out of the form packs, put it down in the comments. What did you get? Because I've I've opened in a few over the years and I've never gotten anything good personally. Oh, a second coin. Oh. We have a Vulpix. Check that out. That's a nice one too. Okay. We're down to our, I think, pretty close to our last couple, couple ones. Got like, what, six? I think six more. Okay, fun pack. Fusion Strike. Come on, Fusion Strike. You've always let me down. Don't let me down today. We have a, a letdown. That's what we have, a letdown. Okay. 20. Next card. Can we get something good? What's it gonna be? We have a Snom. Check him out. We'll take it. We'll take it. I really enjoy these just because they do have the stamp. I do like to collect stamps. And these are stamps. So they make some it makes them unique, you know. Like sure there might be a Scott Paldell involved. There might be, you know, a ton of common snoms and hollows, but you know, there's only a finite amount of, of those guys. Tinker ton or Tinker Tank. Okay, we're coming off the screen over here. Just realized it. Let's see. Behind door number... What was that? Door number 22. We have a stuck card. Work with me here. Don't open. Once you closed. Okay. We have... Let's see. Vulpix. No, we, we didn't have that one last year. Did we have that one last year? I'm really going to have to go back and, and look at the other ones now. I don't think we did. Let's see, for this sticker sheet, definitely going with the blue theme all the way around for this year. Last year was red. wonder what next year will be. There's a sticker of that stamp. I really like that one. That one's nice. Okay, final countdown, last two. Oh, another, oh this one's the one that has the little promo in the back. What do we have? Man. Wonder what it is. I'm really nervous now. Okay, let's see. Three, two, one. Okay, Glaceon VMAX pairing it up. I see what they did there. I think they did the same thing last year with Ice Rider, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, and then behind door number 25 for our last day is a pack. And we have a Paldale Evolve. 
Can we end it with one more good hit? That'd be pretty wild. Let's see. Code card. Let's see. Coupon. Krogunk. Electrode. Giraffe. Pinchern. Therapeutic energy going into a Magnemite. And our last one for the day is... And then on an Abomin Snow. Actually, this was one of them last year. And that one's really cool. I like that one. No, not this one. One similar to it, though. This one couldn't have been last year. Definitely not. But an Abomin Snow was one with the, with the stamps last year. But not this particular card. Alright, let's recap real quick on what we got. So, I paid... I think it was like $50 retail for the whole box. So $50 gets you quite a bit. Definitely something fun to open. Um, your mileage with the hits on the packs will vary, definitely. I would assume so. But out of the packs, we got the Magnezone, the Faulkner, and then promo-wise, let's see. We get the Glaceon, got that Pikachu, that Glass Theorier, Cryognal, Vulpix. I'm not, I'm not doing these in the same order because uh, I don't remember the order anymore. This Nom, the Stantler. I think the Stantler might, the Stantler and the Pikachu are probably my two favorite ones, honestly. And then we did get the Glaceon at the end to pair up with. The V, so you get the V and the V Max with the Snowflake. Definitely pretty cool. We also got the the keychain. It's a real pretty keychain, and the Snom, the Vulpix, and outside of that, I think that's pretty much it. Unless I'm missing something in the mess. Well, the two sticker sheets. We'll put them in there as well. Two sticker sheet sticker sheets. <laughs> so this is pretty much everything that comes in the box. Um, I got, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, uh, well, we got a good amount of stuff, definitely. Um, it's not one of those things where you'll probably be super profitable if you're opening stuff to be profitable for, but it's definitely a fun one. Definitely, I mean, maybe if you grade these, send them off, and send them off to get graded, come back, and then they might be, because they do have the stamps, um, we'll see how that goes. Uh, as, as the year progresses and we start seeing these come out and stuff. But, I mean, they're cool. I, I personally like them. I like the stamp ones. I have the ones from last year over here as well. Let's see. So these are the ones from last year. I will say the the main difference that I've noticed is last year the only one that was actually sealed was the Ice Rider V Max, um, and this year all of them are actually sealed, which is really nice. I personally like my promos to be sealed like this most of the time. I keep them in top orders, kind of like this, or uh, BCC cards, whatever you want to call them, semi rigids. But these are the ones from last year. There's uh you know there's uh the pair. I guess I had a Pikachu last year too. I just noticed that. And then the bomb in the snow. So pretty, pretty, pretty cool. I personally like them. I think it was a cool one. Definitely excited to be opening it way ahead of time. Hopefully it's way ahead of time. I'll, I will have to see how actually ahead of time it is. It could be releasing right now for all I know. Or this morning and I just realized, didn't realize it. But with that said guys, I think I've kept y'all long enough. As always, thanks for watching. Let me know which one's your favorite item out of it. And take care. We'll see you on the next one.